Welcome back again. This is The Inner Voice, and I'm Dr. Fujan Zain, and I'm delighted to have Dr. Fardot Fateri, who's the president and the CEO of International Education Corporation, which owns and operates accredited college across colleges across the United States. He is the author of A Culture of Excellence, The Art, Discipline, and Practice of Breakthrough Leadership. Dr. Fateri is a part of a small group of chief executives in American higher education today with significant experience in the imperative but rare interwoven triad of academic operations and business verticals with over 25 years of experience in higher education and graduating from UC Irvine and Harvard universities. Dr. Fateri has served as a professor, department chair, Dean, Regional Director, College President, Division President, Chief Academic Officer, everything you could ever imagine, Board Director and President and CEO of several medium to large size nonprofit, market funded, and privately held systems. And we have him with us now. Welcome, Dr. Fateri. Thank you so much. Thank you for the invitation. Happy to be here. Wonderful. You also talk about um, utilizing intuition. Intuition is one of those words which is very interesting because especially when it comes to uh, looking at numbers, when it uh, comes to um, in an organization where there's a common goal that you have to go forward and you have uppers uh, that you have to listen to and all of that, where is it that you're actually uh, looking at intuitive sense is that you're talking about it in the relations between uh, and among uh, people, uh, co-workers or management or with students or possibly decision making that they're bringing their intuition. Um, mm -hmm. And how do they how do they know um, how to touch and, and inspire themselves within that type of an intuition? Yeah, that's an excellent question. Um, so I've got to stop saying that because all your questions Questions have been ex excellent Thank so you. far, <laughs> uh, but um, you know when we talk about intuition, uh, you know most organizations, and we are we are not an exception uh, because we are very analytically based organization. We're we're very we make decisions based on evidence. Uh, we are very analytical. We are very report driven, and I think a lot of larger organizations are that way. But there comes a point uh, that you have to use your gut and your intuition uh, to go with what you believe is right. Uh, for example, when I interview people, this is for me personally, you know, you always look at experience and, and you always look at exper expertise uh, based on the person's background. And, and, and of course, beyond that, you, you always try to gauge uh, cultural fit uh, with the person. But then when it comes to to two to three people, you have to ultimately make a decision. And, and as analytical as you can be, you have to use your gut to say, this person is going to fit best within your team. And this person is going to work best with all the team players and within the culture and within the community you have uh, developed. Because every person you employ, uh, even when you have very clear standards and values for your culture, uh, every person you add to your organization inherently will influence your culture. Um, so you've got to be very cautious in how you hire people. And uh, we, you know, that's, for example, for me, that's when I use my intuition. And, uh, you know, I'm not very good at it. I would say I have to say I'm 50 50 when it comes to hiring people. Uh, but there's so much analytics can do when you're dealing within an organization that has people, whether, and you're, you know, for us, it's all about service and people because our, you know, you have your employees and plus your customers uh, uh, are, are people. So we don't have products to sell. So you, intuition plays a big role um, in contributing to your, to your success. Wonderful. Um Dr. Fardot Fateri, who has uh, created, and uh, it's an e-book, uh, A Culture of Excellence, The Art Discipline and the Practice of Breakthrough Leadership. Uh, Dr. Fateri, where can people get your book? Um, actually, the book is also uh, sold in paperback. Uh, it is available in digital format. Mm -hmm. My co-author, James York, and I are very excited to have that. 
uh, Amazon is probably the fastest and most accessible uh, way to the book.